we were at a mutual friend's house and there was this guy, Tony, there who kind of was a little pompous. <laughs> Tony has a psychology degree and he likes to um, diagnose people. He was like, oh, you're gonna be in love with your ex forever and blah, blah, blah. And I was like, who are you to diagnose me and my feelings? And that's where the pompousness kind of came from. Heels on the bus go round and round. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Hi. So this is Elise Kristen Clark. She is named after my sister. I think that anyone who's dating knows the struggle it is to try to find the person who you want to invest your life with. And you look for the qualities and the different aspects of someone who you know you can go through the rest of life's ups and downs with. Tony, I made a promise to God that if he would give me a child, I will always be there for him. And that child will warn for nothing. In my heart, I gave my promise. I was so blessed when I had you. It was the happiest day of my life. the first time like he asked me out separately we went to high tops and it was like and I'm gonna cry <laughs> and it was like right before I lost my sister he was there for me the picture of my mom what does the charm say Missing you as I walk down the aisle. So we're gonna put this on Amanda's bouquet so she'll, she'll be, be there in the spirit. moment. Exactly. It was on my birthday. He got down on one knee and said, Amanda Marie Clark, will you marry me? First thing I said, our wedding date is going to be August 24th. No. <laughs> is, this, is this real? This is going to be a mean joke if it's not real. Yeah, that's mean. Because he said the middle name. So and, he's, and he said, of Heard course it. it's real. And I was like, of course I'll marry you. So. God, you're beautiful. Amanda, in your letter you said that your relationship is very special, that Tony became your rock to lean on very early on in your relationship. From that moment, he proved that he can be the rock for your life, too. That's why you're here today. I remember when you called me at 1 o'clock in the morning, and you were so happy that you couldn't wait to tell me that you asked Amanda to marry you. And you said, she said yes. Your entire life, I've been so proud of you. Well, well not, maybe not every day, but. Um, found the perfect woman for you. She is loving and caring. Her heart is as big as yours. It's wonderful to know that she would take care of you the way you would take care of her. I, Tony, take you, Amanda, to be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, and in sickness and in health. I, Amanda, take you, Tony, to be my husband, to love you, and to honor you. 
all the days of my life. It is my pleasure to present to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Tony Lang. comforted Amanda through some hard times in life. He's helped raise faith and loves her so much, I can tell. In good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, come what may. Tony received this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. Whatever else comes in the future, I know that they're going to tackle it head on and they're going to make a great team because that's what they do. They already do that now. Nothing's going to change because that's how they are already. So.